Hello, everybody, defense here, and welcome to Minecraft Vanilla 1.15. We are here, set, and ready to go in our new world. And just like any Minecraft game, we have to start by punching some wood. Boom. I haven't played Minecraft. I haven't, well, I haven't played vanilla Minecraft in so long that I forgot these things pop up. But we are here in version 1.15.2 to uh, get started and going on some things. Actually, let me just adjust, it's a little loud. We'll just throw it to 30 for now. But I have a lot of fun for this. Um, some of the things I'm gonna go over quickly, you'll see some differences. I am playing vanilla, but it is vanilla tweaked. Um, you'll see, I, I might actually get rid of the numbers. They're kind of annoying and they're kind of blocked. <laughs> um, but I have the numbered hotbar. I actually have a bunch of stuff. Um, I have the Vanilla Tweaks resource pack. All of this will be linked down below if you guys want to use any of it. Along with the site where you can create your own pack. So I will link that all down below for you guys. I'm going to be that guy and leave that tree. <laughs> I know. I'm a terrible human being. But we have some stuff to do. And it's only me, so I don't really mind. Whoop. I didn't want to actually do that. But we have to. Boom, boom, boom. But yeah, as I was saying, we have a lot going on. We have a little bit of food. This is what I was worried about, was not getting food. I'm gonna break those just to uh, break them. And we'll be able to get going. So I have a couple of plans for this series. The upside is I have plans. Downside is I don't have a name yet. So we're gonna end up having to do that. But whilst we're thinking about that, what I'm going to do is get the basics out of the way whilst we chit chat a bit more. But yeah, as I was saying, our goals for this series are pretty simple. I want to do some things I've never really done before. One of them being, I want to actually complete Minecraft. You know, I have never, <laughs> that's a little tiny guy. I've never actually beaten Minecraft. You know what I mean? And, well, like, yeah, don't get me wrong, I've, like, I've defeated the dragon, which, you know, that's, that's, for a long time was considered the end-all, be-all of Minecraft, which is perfectly fine, but what I want to do is I want to get all the bosses, so I want to fight all of them, I want to clear the temple, I want to clear a mansion, I want to take on the wither, you know, all the usual stuff, and honestly, I haven't taken on a monument in forever. And I also have never taken on a mansion. We also have pillagers in this update too, and bees. Bees are something I am really looking forward to because I have not played with them at all. So I think that'll be a fun thing to work with. This is actually very helpful. I'm gonna grab some of this and we'll be able to go from there. But I also want, you know, as I said, like a, a cool base. I don't remember, I cut out a bunch of this cause I didn't like where the conversation was going, but some stuff might still be here. <laughs> The other stuff, as I was saying, not a big base, but like I have multiple base ideas that I want to build. And the first one, I haven't decided which one I'm going to do first, actually, now that I think about it. But I do already have an area picked out for it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get us over there, get that conversation, uh, get some of this stuff along the way. And uh, once we get over there, we will continue this conversation. So. I'll see you guys in just a moment. We have made it. So this is where I plan on having our first base, to be honest. There are a couple of reasons that I picked this location, and those reasons are underground mainly but not entirely. So what I'm gonna do is I am going to switch over to our camera account. Here we are on the camera account, as I had said, and for whatever reason, I'm looking over my back and it looks painful. But we'll, uh, we'll forget about that creepy picture for a second. The reason I ended up picking this world is I went on a chunk base and I wanted to find a multi-spawner setup. And sadly, I couldn't find many. Um, I did find a couple of doubles, most of them were double zombies, but I was lucky enough to eventually come across what I thought was a triple, um, it's listed as a, uh, it ended up being a skelly spawner and a zombie spawner, and I was kind of bummed because I couldn't find out where the third one is, well it's down there, <laughs> which is really sad, it's far enough away where it's not, we can't affect it from here. 
but it is another skelly spawner we might play around with that in the future but we do have two spawners here and here for us to play with to uh, start off this season and then after that once I came above the ground I saw we were in a swamp and I went hmm swamp I, I kind of like the swamps. I don't have issues with them. I know a lot of people think they're icky and they have like bad colors But if you go up ever so slightly over the trees right there you see a witch hut and They have witches which is awesome. So we now have a dual spawner set up and a witch hut sorry if you can hear my goats Somebody's uh, somebody's out with the goats, so the goats are bleating at everybody. But hey, that's perfectly fine. But yeah, this is the start of our first base, and I think I'm gonna uh, just kind of get started. So I'm gonna step away for a bit and figure out what it is I'm going to need. We're gonna gather up some resources. Obviously, you can see there's plenty of trees around. We'll have to dig and set up a mine, but this is gonna be the center of our base. So that way I just have plenty of area to work with and play around with. So let me get started on that and I'll bring you guys right on back once we have some stuff to work with. Woo! So welcome back everybody. We have been doing a bit of work. We got some eerie noises. Um, I haven't really done much in the way of other resource gathering. All I've done so far is I nabbed a couple of animals. Actually, one of the sheep got away because I was being stupid. And I planned what I want to do for my starting house. So, as I said, when we were here earlier, we were going to put our base out here. That's where our base is going to be. That's where we're going to start. Uh, that's where it's the eventual base is going to be. I actually might move it back a little now since we're building this here. But this is where our starter house is going to be. It is a very odd shape. I'm not gonna lie it is a very odd shape but I started working with it oh <laughs> I forgot I have the old damage sound on I love it sorry distractions aside I kind of just like freeformed the house and I like it so this is the foundation for it it will go down more and we'll get rid of like the dirt and stuff but we're gonna do all of the building in the form of a third person time lapse which I think will be fun, but I think I have everything I need for it. I probably need more, but for now, I think that's it. And I am personally going to get started building it. I'm either going to chat or play some music. I have not decided yet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get started building and uh, yeah, you'll hear what uh, ends up happening. So I'll talk to you guys in just a moment.
I don't know about you guys, but this place makes me happy. I don't usually build, like, if you've watched for a while, you, you know, on, on Twitch or any prior series, I don't normally build, like, a house. And so far, I'm very happy with it. Obviously, there's some stuff we have to add. It is very flat. Hold on, let me grab this. I love this diminishing tool things, by the way. I didn't notice that it would also do it, like, in my hand. So if you look on the right, like, it, it's literally just like a little chunk of a sword. <laughs> and it looks awesome, and I didn't know that actually happened whilst it went. I gotta cover this thing up. I've almost fell, fallen in it. Fell in. I've almost fallen in it, like, four or five times. But... We finished up our little run through, which is funny. We left and went diagonally that way, and we came in from over there. <laughs> we just made some big loop out there on our way back. Because it was like, ah, I think this is the right direction. You know, but, okay. So, changes since the time lapse. I added in a roof. I did not do the roof initially because I didn't know how I wanted to do the roof. So, I hopped back over to my creative world and did the roof. It is honestly a mess. <laughs> <laughs> because there's so many different nubs to this building. But I'm happy. I, I like it. You know what I mean? I really do like it. You know, I'm, I'm happy with it. I added another set of stairs here and added a second porch off to the side there. And then on the inside, there's really nothing. <laughs> I threw in some barrels because I can use them. So I'm not going to use chests anymore because that's dumb. Why would you use chests? Oop, I hear a skelly. He's going to be upstairs, isn't he? No, he's not. I have no idea. He's probably right outside, but we'll leave him alone for now. I moved my bed inside. Let's actually change our spawn point back to that. But I, as I was saying, I'm very happy with it. I, I just got to figure out what I want to do because, as I said, it's very plain on the big flats. And really, decorating is is my biggest struggle for, for me personally, I, I think. If you guys have watched in the past, I bring it up all the time. I brought it up a ton in the Tectopia modded series we just did but the first thing we're going to do is something i had planned on doing and i was like hey once i get shears i can do this but we pass through a taiga a taiga a taiga i don't know one of those is right and we found some of the mossy cobble so i want to put that in i'm gonna have to figure out where this skeleton is he's driving me nuts He does sound like he's right below. I really shouldn't do this because I only have a tiny bit of durability on my sword. No, it sounds like he's in there. Alright, well, we'll leave him. We'll let him do his thing. Yank, let's throw those in. But yeah, we're going to have to... We're really going to have to decorate this side up. But I need to do the sleep. So, let's run under here. Is this still messed up? Okay, no. <laughs> one of those... One of the waters there changed color. And it was really weird. And I could not for the life of me figure out why. Oh, that's, that's stupid. Because he's right underneath. There we go. I'll just have to figure out where that is and light it up. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. All right. But we're going to sleep in our little storage nook for now. But yeah, so plans for this area. This is going to be where I sleep. Um, That's where that stuff's going to be. I might throw my temporary smelters in here. Or I might do something up here. And either enchanting is going to go here, one, two, three, four, five, or over here, one, two, three, four, five. It might go here just because it's a little bit deeper. Uh, and I think that'll work. But I don't know for sure. So I haven't guaranteed, you know, I'm not guaranteeing that yet. But I think that will look nice. And oh, I can't, I can't remember if I pointed these out, but I did pick up a couple of dudes, and one of them did get out of a boat. I, I broke the boat and he ran away. I'll pick them up later. Uh, I also have a couple of chicken eggs, so we'll be good there. But I think that's a pretty solid start for episode one. This took way longer than I thought because I am not really a builder. So when it does come to building things, man, do I forget how much work it is. Oh, that looks better already. I do kind of wish I did a, an indent now that I'm looking at everything, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine. So with that, though. I want to thank you for stopping in. If you guys did enjoy, please do let me know with a like down below. And ideas for decorations in the comments are very, very much appreciated. Again, sorry for the shorter episode, it's especially for episode one. 
but we have a lot of resource gathering to do and I want to get on that so I hope to see you in the next one and I hope you all have a nice night day morning evening whatever it is wherever you are this is my defense I hope to see you again soon peace